Well, what we haven't talked about is collaboration. And yeah. any, any sort of creativity, whatever you are, even if you're a fine artist, it is yeah. about collaboration. Yeah. And you are quite specific about what you bring to the party, the visual, the imaginative. But you, yeah. you, you always work with great writers. Well, I have to because I'm not a very good writer. I mean, I can write situation, I can write the ideas, I, I can have ideas about the characters, but I don't write good dialogue. It's very simple. And so I always work with people who can. And I love working. And I, I think that comes from, you know, once you're in a group like Python, and even though I was separate to some degree, it was always collaborative. And I love working with other people. And it's one reason I got bored with animation, because it's just me and the paper. And I love other people's ideas. I love the, the, the need that I have to argue for why I want something. I've got to convince somebody else, which is very important, rather than just saying, I want it. Um, and so the whole process, and I, I love also, and that's when the actors really become wonderful, because you've spent a year or so writing it, preparing it, getting all everything ready, and you go to work, and now the actors come in, and I spend a lot of time choosing, hopefully, the right people. Uh, and then they come in with very different ideas about how to do a scene. And so the, the daily business of shooting becomes surprising all the time. It's yeah. interesting. Yeah. You've got to be on your toes. It's not, it's not me just following my storyboards it's and saying, okay, you do that. Yeah. yeah. And, it's, and the thing, the process, it's, it's very organic in a sense. And then nature comes in and rains when it's supposed to be a sunny day. So everything is shifting it. So the, the whole process is alive. It doesn't mean it's fun. It's, yeah. it, most of the time I'm screaming and tearing my hair out because it's not the way I want it. <laughs> but that's, but the, the point is to, and to surround yourself with people who are really good, who are opinionated, who, don't, who aren't yes men. I watch so many filmmakers and see they're surrounded by yes people. Sick offense. And no, I want people that argue with me that say, what are you doing? I mean, and I, I remember the first time we were doing Time Bandits, I got myself in a corner, literally shooting into a corner, and a whole set is back there, and I couldn't quite make it work, and the prop guy came by, the prop guy, and he says, what are you doing, Terry? And he, prop guy, talking to a director like that, wait a minute, there's a hierarchy, <laughs> hier hierarchy here. No. But he said, what are you doing? He said, Why are you doing it? Well, just do that. I said, what? And basically I said, get out of here. And then I said, I just then stop. He's absolutely right. And so, ever since then, I just listened to everybody, and I'm not um, neurotic or insecure to reject all these ideas because ultimately I'm smart enough to know that I have the ultimate power of deciding yay or nay. And I, I keep saying to people, because uh, people think I'm an auteur. Uh, I'm not, I'm a filter. Yeah. Um, it's what I am. <laughs> that's all. The you ideas are. come from everybody. Yeah. And I get the credit or blame. That's my job. That's all. <laughs>